Finally uh, getting to this build. I meant to do this yesterday, but I found myself um, watching videos on cabling and uh, you know proper proper fan positioning and all that sort of stuff. So um, as I've said before, this is my first PC build. So if you're looking to learn something, you definitely don't want to be watching this. But um, yeah, so it should be should be interesting. I know that some of you guys are, are most likely going to be will be able to do this in 30 minutes to, or, or less or a little bit more but um you know i'm gonna take my time with this because i don't want to i don't want to you know destroy any components or anything like that so i, I in the, at the end of the day i just want this thing to work it doesn't matter how long it takes me to um to build it anyways uh we'll get started here and i'm gonna actually show you guys um what i have here um but i am going to do that with my gopro so it's gonna look a little funny um but it's it's better that i do this with you guys uh showing you guys a little close up <laughs> versus far away so i i'm going to go ahead and put this out there my apartment is a uh, a complete mess in here and i have not taken the time to clean it so it's just a disclaimer <laughs> so i'm just gonna go ahead and kind of lay my uh actually i think i want to get on the other side lay this down and sort of get into the inside of it here is that going to the other fan over there yeah i guess it is so it's probably gonna be hard to see me a little bit, but um, I have this camera, so I think that'll be pretty cool. I'm pretty bad about opening boxes in a very violent way. <laughs> so as most people have said before, at least what I found in my quick little research, a good way to discharge is to just plug this thing in. Made it to a non-painted portion. Well, the whole damn thing seems painted. <laughs> I guess we're discharged now. Um, yeah, uh, I will admit I'm a little bit nervous. Um, when you put money on this sort of stuff, there is always going to be that little bit of worry. All right, so I think we're ready. Let's go ahead and get to the motherboard. Everyone says that bag is not um, not good to set it on, so I am going to avoid that. So I guess the next order of operations is to get the uh, get the processor installed. So I said four um, AMD Ryzen five. Heard good things about it, um, so it should be good for for its purpose. I'm gonna go ahead and get this out. Here's our processor, um, and this does come with its own stock heat sink and uh, fan so I am I am not going to um, I'm not gonna be overclocking it at least not for right now um, so this should be this should be fine uh, I don't know if this came with thermal paste hopefully inside of here we have some because if not I guess that's another trip I have to make and unfortunately, <laughs> it doesn't come with thermal paste. I, um, I'm not really sure why I thought it would, but... Actually, I'm thinking it actually does have um, paste already pre-installed pre on it. Um, I was able to touch that and it's kind of moist, so it may good, be actually good there. I think we were ready to get that on the board. Let's touch this one more time. Actually, let me place this down. Make sure I can get some leverage. I don't want my board falling off the, the box. And that's just the first it goes back. sound <laughs> that looks like it went in perfectly um actually i think i need to take these off i'm not sure they're i guess you remove those um i'm not sure what are those maybe you guys know what that is 
because um, I'm not really sure. Actually, that's gonna be too small. And I don't wanna strip it. Yeah, I'm not really sure what these are. Little things here, but um, yeah. I'm gonna move my power supply and get that out of the way. And I'm actually gonna clamp my leg. I'm gonna go ahead and get this tightened down a little bit. To sort of keep the paste Make sure that the paste, of, I guess, applies evenly across the board. So that little diagonal pattern, just like it would be if you were uh, taking the lug nuts off of your car tire. Okay, so I think I see what the issue is. So the under piece seems to have been pushed out a little bit. <sighs> so. <laughs> After a little hassle, finally got the thing on. Um, I'm not sure these these um, screws were very hard to get into that to the um, connectors, but yeah, I'm not really sure what the case is. Maybe that's just the stock um, the way the stock cooler is, but um, I don't know. Actually, I don't know. I think it'll be fine to go ahead and get that in. So we have that out of the way. So back to my weird head configuration. Um, so I really have to be careful with this GoPro because I don't have um, the little mount point on it is kind of broken. So it's um, increased the risk of this GoPro falling off and hitting the motherboard, and that's probably not going to be too good. So um, to get this thing lined up, um, actually I thought that I would have risers for, it, but I guess maybe that's not the case for for every configuration. I'm not 100% sure. So I found the risers. Um, and the screws so luckily they included something nice and convenient for us to put those in um where is the freaking i'm not so i'm not too familiar with iphones and i have trouble finding where stuff is i'm trying to find a flashlight if they have a flashlight the flash rollers no no flashlight come on that's not even pointing at the all right <laughs> screw it i'm not sure if that's gonna work or not anyways I'm gonna go ahead and get these things in here. You don't have a me. The hell? I can calculate <laughs> oh, that scared the hell out of me. How the hell did I get on that? All right, so I know I have one here. Which I guess I can start these first because they're just gonna fall out of there. That looks like a space there. Six right there. Um, let me tighten these up, or at least make sure that they're tightened to where they should be. Wish this thing was matinated, it would, uh, it would help. There we go. That feels more like it should feel. And again, um, excuse me for my messy apartment. <laughs> I guess I am the typical guy. Uh, I'm not gonna say that, because I'm pretty sure some of you guys are, uh, got your places all nice and neat and organized. I can't even show you the kitchen because the yeah, well let me just stop <laughs> let me stop good that took to put the thing in upside down damn it like exactly what i did <laughs> well, luckily it comes out easily and i was just looking at the thing to see how i was supposed to put it in there and i i clearly saw that these three areas i mean three port holes were were um turned the other way That's definitely too small. So that means that the big one. Yep, perfect. Oh, <laughs> exactly. Of course that's gonna happen. <laughs> I got you. Oh my 
God, no, dude, what are you doing? I need, a, <laughs> I need better tools or maybe I just need to pay a little bit more attention. I'm about to break something. Oops, billing, a PC, <laughs> a new bill. All right, so I think I think I have everyone in there. I'm not gonna tighten them extremely, extremely too much. I don't need to be locked jaw tight. It's a little loose. All right, so I think that's good. Actually, I'm gonna have to pick back up on this in a bit. Um, I probably shouldn't have, but I scheduled in a massage appointment for seven o'clock. Um, because uh, me and some co-workers were going to watch the uh, McGregor Mayweather fight. But I guess that got canceled, um, the meetup. So uh, I was like, I'll, I'll do something else. Um, but yeah, I am going to reconvene in a little bit. Um, of course, that'll seem seamless to you guys. But um, maybe it'll be a little bit darker outside. <laughs> I don't know. But um, yeah, I'll be right back. So I am going to go ahead and get our RAM in here. Um, so I mentioned before that I was going to take a break and come back to this later. Um, and it's been what, about three, four hours or so. And um, I was not going to start back on this tonight, but I figured that I would go ahead. So I'm going to uh, go ahead and get back to it. So guys, <laughs> after, uh, after watching the McGregor Mayweather fight. Um, I, I took a little break and I came back over here. I'm like, let me give this thing one more shot. And I, I look online just to make sure that this RAM was, uh, again, was compatible with this motherboard. And um, I saw a couple four and people were like, just push it down a little bit harder and it should be fine. And uh, sure enough, my first try when I got back over here and it fit. So yeah, it's, it's one of those cases of, um, Sort of like <laughs> like programming was for me when I uh, when I was first doing it back in college, where I'd have that one issue that would bug the hell out of me, and I would just take a break, sleep on it, wake up in the morning, hop back on, and um, get the programming, and I would have it resolved within a couple minutes. <clears throat> I don't know. I think I'm supposed to be touching that, um, but I got the I got the band on. But um, but yeah, so. That's one of those situations. I just got to make sure that I have it. Um, I, maybe I just wasn't pushing it down evenly at the same time on each side, and that just it caused it to um, to not be fully seating properly. So, gonna try to <laughs> get the second um, the second one in here correctly. Also, so video card. Let's go ahead and put it back. Which I guess this one would work over here. I don't see why it wouldn't. I don't want to grab that. Right. And so something wasn't properly in place there. Oh, well that makes sense. <laughs> Another uh, Ricky thing, huh? So yeah, not sure how many of you guys watched the uh, watched the fight. It's pretty good. Um, I've been a boxing fan for many years. Um, been more of a Pacquiao fan. Some of you may or may not know that. Um, which 2000 was 2015 around May or so. That's when Mayweather actually beat Pacquiao, and I wasn't actually I wasn't that disappointed. Um, I don't know, but um, fight today was actually pretty good. Like I said I'm not sure when this video is gonna be uploaded. It'll be uploaded with this um, PC, so if, if, if it doesn't work, then it won't get uploaded. Got to juice up. <laughs> All right, so we got that in. Um, I think we're pretty pretty close to being able to actually. I think I can go ahead and mount my uh, drives, and then I can take the back cover off and and get to wiring. Well, whenever I get to wiring. So I was wondering earlier 
what these extra pieces were and then it came it hit me um at some later time that these are for um them out the hard drive so i more so want this angle so that i don't really block any of the blocking up the air um i guess right here will be fine well only too far down it. I don't think that would be a dust issue or anything. Um, it should be fine down here. I don't see why not. So I'm just gonna put that little bad boy there, and go ahead and get this drive mounted. So some of these screws somewhere around here goes to this. Alright guys, so all the components are in, um, really at this point just the cabling, um, and actually I gotta put the power supply in, but I'm um, gonna go ahead and route some of these cords that are already on here, um, for my USB ports and, and fans and all that sort of stuff, and then I'll get to the rest of the cabling. So yeah, um, sort of on the final stretch right now, and I'm honestly I'm ready to be done with this thing and, and get it booted up, just to uh, see how it's gonna work. So. Yep, I'm gonna begin on that, so uh, yeah. So everything's <laughs> almost together. Um, now down to these power cables. I've been sort of dreading these um, for a good bit of the whole entire project because, um, yeah, there are a lot of cables. <laughs> things are probably gonna start looking ugly now. I'm gonna have to get something to these uh, drivers. All the drives. <sighs> And to sort of put them in their natural positioning where they how they sort of were shaped before um, just so that they won't bend extremely too much I want those hard bags to get into <laughs> got something for you no match for the sharp blade Let's get one of these bright colored ones the yellow one Precaution. <laughs> so yeah, it's it's not overcrowded. Uh, I mean, they the cables have to go somewhere. So I feel like that's um, I feel like that's pretty pretty good. I feel like that's pretty good. Um, a closer look. Not extremely <laughs> extremely clunky or anything. So I know a lot of people are. At least I've seen people um, talk about the cable management is good fit. So, so that's how our that sort of front looks. And like I said, if I could just get this closed up with those, then that should be fine. So I, I think we're, we're pretty much at that point where we um, kind of hook up the monitor and, and test this thing out, which I wasn't going to do tonight. But you know, I've got, gotten this far, so I think that's probably about the best thing to do, actually. Yeah, I may want to go ahead and get a monitor hooked up to it. Um, all right, I gotta clean off this tape for a second. <laughs> all right, guys. So I guess this is the moment of truth. <laughs> so let's uh, let's hope this thing starts. Uh, all right.
Here we go. <laughs> soon. Alright, it's probably just, I don't have a keyboard or anything hooked up. So, yep. Look for a boot device. So, um, <laughs> looks pretty sick. <laughs> um, of course, this is always like the scariest moment, knowing whether or not this thing's going to work, but, you know, so far it looks like everything is looking pretty good. So, um, yeah, pretty pretty happy about that. Um, I have not made my boot disc yet. I have the OS, but um, it's it's 5 p.m. or well, it's 5 a.m. and I haven't gotten any sleep yet, so I am going to do that tomorrow. <laughs> but anyways, guys, I hope you've enjoyed this. Um, and I've had fun, and like I said, it, it took a long time, and I. I I'm kind of hesitant to say actually how many hours I actually put into this because I was doing a lot of back and forth, um, you know, looking up things and, you know, just making sure that I had everything correct. And, um, you know, like I said, there were those those couple things that kind of slew me, slowed me down, um, like those RAM, those RAM slots um, and that that cooler. And um, like I said, I've been kind of, I've been kind of back and forth, um, you know, throughout the day and just didn't get a chance to just put a, a lot of time just directly to it but um yeah overall um everything looks good so anyways guys like i said hope you i hope you've enjoyed um stick around for more and uh i'll see you next time oh and if you want to know any of the um the the stuff that i have in here the components uh, let me know i actually i may just include that in the description um so you know check that out if, if there's any interest um but yeah talk to you guys later see you